Hey guys, it's Woodsman Survival, and today I'm going to be sh doing a review on the Yuko Stormproof Matches, so stay tuned. Hey guys, it's Woodsman Survival. So like I said, today we're going to be doing a review of the Yuko Stormproof Matches on Amazon. They retail for $8.65, and you can get it in green, orange, or yellow. And so when you open this up, what you get is, here's the lid. It's just a cotton ball that they have in there. And... It comes with 25 matches in here. I did buy a refill pack to put in there. And that little that little plastic bag right there has two extra strikers in there. So, like I said, you can buy the refills. And I, they just look like this. And if you don't want this case, which I did want this case, so I bought it. But these, the refills are only like... Probably like three dollars and i'll put a link on amazon for these and these and so first of all we're going to be going over the specs and first of all like i already said it includes 25 wind and waterproof matches and it comes with three strikers this one was inside the package when you buy it it says it holds up to 40 matches i've not tried that out yet but it says they're easy to light, and they'll burn up to 15 seconds each, and they will burn being submerged in water. I'll do a test for that, too. Waterproof, durable, ABS, plastic case, floats. I'll do a test for that, too. First of all, I'm just going to strike a match, cotton ball out, and I'll show you how that cotton ball burns. Okay, so I'm just going to take this cotton ball and fluff it out. How the cotton ball that they give you lights up. That went up really well. Now, we're going to go over and I'm going to stick this match in the snow. And I'm going to see how okay, that guys. burns. So now I'm going to be doing a test and sticking these in the snow. So, sorry, the picture might be a little bit more grainy, but I just zoomed in so you could get a better look. So, I'm just going to probably stick it in this pile of snow. So. Okay, so it's burning good. And it's back up again. It's still burning inside the snow. So it finally did go out. But that was pretty crazy. You saw it was still burning in the snow. You can see that's what it did to the snow. So right this there. is going to be the float test and the, the waterproof test of these uh, Yuko stormproof matches. Now from my previous experiments, experiences, I really like these matches. But uh, today I'm going to be putting these to the test. So what you want to do... When you keep them in your kit, is just keep the lid really, really tight so no water gets inside there. If you did drop it in the water, or for some reason it didn't float. Now, as you can see, I'm almost chasing this thing around. It's trying to float right back to the top. So they did a great job there. Now, they also claim that the, uh, I'm not, when I say that they claim, I'm not trying to say that they're lying, but I haven't proven that it works yet, so I'm just using that term claim. So they claim that the waterproof ring around here will keep everything inside dry. Okay. I cranked that lid on there super hard and I couldn't get it off. Okay, everything inside is dry. Okay, guys, the extra strikers that they have in there, the bag is uh, heat sealed. So, no water. Even if the water did leak in the case, it won't get in that bag. Sorry about that annoying bird. If you're not going to need to start a fire right away, I'd suggest keeping uh, your striker on the inside of your case. 
just so if you did happen to drop it in the water, it wouldn't get all wet. So these things do take a second to flare up that they can burn underwater. And you see it bubbling. And you guys might not be able to see it, but it's still burning. So. That is pretty crazy. I probably already said this, but for the price, what's on the market, I think these are some of the best matches. Now, for Christmas, I also did get the Yuko Titan matches. I'll be doing a review of those in the future. Those matches are pretty crazy. So, again, they take a second to flare up. You dug them under the water. And it's burning again. Come on. Okay, it's, it's done now. But I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, it helped me out by hitting that thumbs up button. And if you're not already subscriber to me and you want to be, click right over there. And if you want to check out my last video, click right there. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.